Hello, my name is Saif Gallagher. I am a plastic and reconstructive surgeon with a special interest in gender affirmation surgery. And uh, so today's question is, can transgender women get breast cancer? And if so, what sort of screening do we need to do for transgender women? Do transgender women need mammograms? So, of course, like a lot of things, unfortunately, in uh, gender health, we don't have a lot of long-term evidence about what the long-term effects of being on hormones are. However, we do have two pretty useful studies. Um, one um, came from Holland, actually. And in that particular study, they looked at 2,307 transgender women and looked at their risk and compared them to non-transgender women. So what they found was it looks like that risk, risk is pretty lower. Um, um, so how they looked at this, how they measured it, it's kind of complicated. What they look at is uh, patient years. So what they looked at is the incidence. So the amount of times you're gonna um, somebody's gonna have breast cancer per hundred thousand patient years. Okay, so in um, non-transgender women, that number was 155 per hundred thousand. Um, patient years because breast cancer unfortunately is very common whereas in the transgender women we only saw it about four per hundred thousand patient years so this would seem to apply that even though a transgender woman will develop breasts will um, when she's exposed to hormones the risk doesn't seem to be quite as high uh, the only similar re study we have in the United States is one looking at um, transgender women in the VA and and same thing again, it seems that that risk is lower. And we know that definitely the risk is related to how long you're on the feminizing hormones. So therefore, the guidelines that we currently use um, knowing that the risk is lower is we don't recommend um, that transgender women need mammograms until the age of 50. They don't have to get them as commonly as non-transgender women, which will be every year. So instead, transgender women only need mammograms um, every two years. And then the other thing is you really have to have um, significant exposure to the feminizing hormones really to have this increased risk. So therefore, um, the this screening only starts, these mammograms only starts when the patient has been on at least five years of hormones. So just to summarize again, um, transgender women should get mammograms after the age of 50 every two years once they've been on hormones uh, for five years. Uh, so I hope you find this helpful.